this video, we'll show you how to scan forms and create reports using your Scantron Score test scoring machine and Remark Classroom Edition software. With your Scantron Score and Remark Classroom Edition, you can save time with the ability to score up to 40 tests per minute, share a standalone test scoring machine within departments, floors, or schools, transfer results using a standard USB drive, export your results to your grading system for analysis, and analyze and report on student test data. To begin, scan your forms as usual using your Scantron score and transfer the results to your computer using a USB drive. For more information about scanning forms and transferring data, visit ScantronScore.com. Next, open Remark Classroom Edition and click Import Scantron Score Data. Click Browse and select the data file you want to use for your reports. Make sure Retrieve Student Names from an Excel Spreadsheet is selected. Click the Select link in the Excel File column to specify a file containing the student names and IDs. Click Browse, select the Excel file, and click Open. Click OK. If you want the reports to load automatically after importing the data, select Automatically Load Test Results. Click Import. The results display in a spreadsheet with the information from the form and can include items such as the test ID, student ID, student name, and the results for each question. You can use the quick grade or advanced grade options to grade your tests. We'll use quick grade here. For more information about grading tests, see the Remark Quick Stats User's Guide. The Remark Quick Stats application opens in a separate window and displays a list of reports in the task pane on the left. We'll talk about two of the reports here. The Student Statistics Report provides a list of students and their grades on the test. If you defined a benchmark, a blue line appears for the benchmark and displays a bar chart indicating which students did and didn't meet the benchmark. The green bars represent students who scored higher than the benchmark, and the red bars represent students who scored lower than the benchmark. For more information about defining a benchmark, see the Remark Quick Stats User's Guide. The Condensed Test Report provides a summary of basic statistics for the test. The top portion of the report provides high-level statistics for the test, such as the total possible points, standard deviation, median and mean scores, as well as the reliability coefficient and scoring ranges. The table provides detailed information for each question on the test, including the list of all questions, the correct answer, and the frequencies of each response. The report also highlights distractors that were selected more frequently than the correct answer. On this question, we can see that students selected the distractor more frequently than the correct answer, which could indicate flaws in the question. The non-distractor column lists answer choices that were not selected. The Correct Group Responses section provides a breakdown of students answering the question correctly, including the total percentage of students who answered the question correctly and the number of students in the upper and lower 27% who answered the question correctly. The report calculates a point by serial based on the class responses. With Remark Classroom Edition and Scantron Score, you can use your existing tests and processes to access accurate and reliable reports, giving you the ability to analyze student performance so you can create instruction unique to your students. For more information, go to ScantronScore.com or see the Remark Classic OMR User's Guide.